Okay, the third example, determine if the statement is true or false. If false, show a counterexample. So remember a counterexample was um, an example of the opposite. So you're showing, you're showing an example of a statement that is false. And um, here is the statement. If the measures of the sides of a triangle are x, y, and z, and the measures of the sides of a second triangle are x plus 1, y plus 1, and z plus 1, the two triangles are similar. So here is triangle 1. Let's say this is triangle 2. So that means if this is x, y, and z, this is x plus 1, y plus 1, and z plus 1, are they similar? So uh, we have to, what you can do is you can just start plugging in numbers for x, y, and z and seeing if they're going to have the same ratio. So let's say we're going to use the numbers 4, 5, and 6. Well, x plus 1 is 5, y plus 1 is 6, and z plus 1 is 7. So let's see if the ratios are going to be the same. So x, this one to this one is 4 to 5. This one to this one is 5 to 6. And I'm putting a question mark over the equal sign because I'm trying to see if they're equal. I don't know if they're equal yet. So 6 to 7. Now, I don't think they're the same. If you want to double check, well, let's work with this first. Um, we can use cross products to see if this ratio is equal to this ratio because proportions mean that they have to be the same. Proportions, a correct proportion would be that this ratio is equal to this ratio. Um, so we're going to see if that works. So then cross products, 4 times 6 is 24 equal to 25. No, they're not equal. So automatically, I don't have to check the second one because, or the last one because these two I know are not the same. So here's my counterexample, right, showing it, it's an example of the statement that shows it's false. Okay, and this shows it's false. So um, that's my answer and that's my counterexample. False. Now for this to be true, if it was x, y, and z, then it would have to be multiplied. It can't be x plus 1. You can't add 1. So if I multiply each one of these by 2, then it would have the same factor, a scale factor. Um, but again, if, it's, if you add a number, then it's not going to be the same.